There's a shakeup at Sony Pictures nearly three months after the studio was the target of a massive cyber attack. Amy Pascal is out as co-chairman and head of the film studio. Pascal had to apologize in December for racist comments she made and leaked emails, but she will stay at the studio launching a new entertainment venture. Jodie Foster received a Lifetime Achievement Award at the Athena Film Festival in New York. The festival highlights films that focus on women in leadership roles. You know, it's a funny thing, the Lifetime Achievement Award, because I don't feel that old. Um, but then I look back and I realize that um, I've been doing a lot of things. The festival also features the New York premiere of Dreamcatcher, a documentary about one woman's fight to end human trafficking. Melissa Etheridge was among artists who performed at the annual Grammy Foundation Legacy Concert. The event highlights the recording industry's commitment to preserving its musical heritage. Well, I've been, uh, you know, connected with the Grammy Foundation for a long time. They've just been doing so much great work for so, so, such a long time. The concert is part of Grammy Week, a series of events leading up to music's biggest night this Sunday. And in honor of the Grammys, today's episode of Let's Make a Deal features music legend Smokey Robinson. That's your eye on entertainment. Suzanne Marquez, CBS News, Hollywood.